Hello everyone. In this video, I will show you how to do a VLOOKUP in Excel with two spreadsheets. So let's get started. When you're searching for information using a VLOOKUP in Excel, it's uncommon to have all the data you need in a single table. Most of the time, you'll need to pull data from multiple sheets. There are various complex methods to achieve this, but today I'm going to show you the simplest and most straightforward approach. First, open your Excel workbook. As you can see, I've already prepared two sheets for this demonstration. In sheet one, I have the results for a group of students. Now, I need to compare the students' results in sheet one with the data in sheet two. How can we do this? There's a simple formula that makes it easy. Here's what you need to do. Start by typing equals to VLOOKUP. Bracket start, the first argument is the lookup value. This is the value you want to find. Select the cell containing this value. Next, enter a comma and select the table array, which is the range of cells where you want to search for the value. Since we're looking in sheet one, you'll reference it like this. Sheet one exclamation sign a colon C. This tells Excel to look in columns A through C of sheet one. After another comma, specify the column index number. This tells Excel which column in your table array contains the data you want to retrieve. In our case, it's column three. Finally, type false for an exact match, close the brackets and press enter. You'll see the result immediately. To apply this to the entire column, simply drag the formula down. This method is the easiest way to compare data across multiple sheets using VLOOKUP in Excel. If this video helped you out, make sure to join the Show Me Software Free Newsletter. It's linked in the description below. In this newsletter, I will tell you about the latest software tools and AI that can make you more productive at work and also improve your personal life in many different ways. You can also reply to these emails with any technical support questions you might have, and I'll do my best to help you out for free. This newsletter is completely free and will always be free. So click the link in the description to sign up.